Hey loves, what's up and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing another video with you guys and I have this wig from By Nice Hair. It did just come in this bag right here and it also came with a wig cap. But this is what the wig looks like. It is a highlight, I, I believe so. I think these are highlights. Um, this is what the wig looks like. This is what the wig looks like. It has very, very beautiful curls. I am able to run my fingers through the wig with no problem. It's really pretty. I feel like I want to do a wet style kind of with this one. It's super beautiful. The knots are not bleached, so they are a little bit dark. So we are. I am going to be bleaching that, so no worries. This is what the inside of the wig looks like this is actually kind of different than any other wig that i've used this is pretty interesting so i'm assuming that you just go with the straight part for it to be longer because as you see like that's where the lace is at that's very interesting i've never seen a wig with is like the lace like this um and then in the back this is what the tracks look like it has one two three three clips I'm going to go ahead and bleach the knots on this wig and then once I come back, we're going to go ahead and install this wig. Alright you guys, so today I'm going to be showing you guys a step by step on how to, how I install my wigs. I recently started switching it up a little bit. I'm not doing some things and I'm doing some things the front, you know what I mean? So I'm going to go ahead and give you guys my new step by step um, wig installation. This thing's actually going to need some gel. I use Got To Be Glue because it's really, really good. It's like super, super strong. Um, but you can use a different gel if you'd like, but you're gonna need got to be glued regardless because that's the Glue that you're gonna be using. I typically used to use um, the bold hold and that one's really good too But that's more for long term like a little bit longer wear. I typically only put on my wigs wear for like the whole day and then I take them off when it's time to lay down So I don't need a glue that you know lasts longer than that. So the got to be glue always you know does the trick so since my hair is already in a bun i'm just gonna leave it like that and i also have my blow dryer in hand and you'll see why in a minute so first things first i'm gonna go ahead and squeeze them out and then i've got this edge brush and i'm gonna go ahead and dip it in here as you guys can see i put a lot i'm gonna be using a lot so so I'm basically just going to put gel right here in the front. I don't feel like I need to put it anywhere else because this just protects my baby hairs from being pulled off. So yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and do that. Right on the line.
pushing you away while I want you to stay. Amazing God is eyes, but my heart still beats. When I say no, it's yes. I'm putting you to the test. Can you handle me? Do you have the key? Sorry that I've been playing games. Do you really have what it takes? I guess so, I guess so. I guess so, I guess so. I am a queen, I need my king. You better. Hey guys, so that's pretty much it for gluing it on. So now I'm just gonna go ahead and do all that all the way around and then I'll be back for the next step. All right, you guys, so the hair is starting to dry up. I am gonna end up putting more water in it to make it flatten out a little bit more. But now I'm gonna go ahead and pluck the hairline to make this look a little bit more realistic. I'm gonna go put I'm gonna put some water in my hair. I'm gonna go ahead and put some of gel on it because like I said I wanna have like the wet look. So I'm just showing you guys the difference when it's wet versus when it's dry. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that instead. All right, you guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and go do my makeup and I will be right back when I'm done. But God damn, it's looking real cute. I love the wet look with this wig, it's super bomb. I can't wait to see what I look like in glam. All right, you guys, so this is the finished look of the wig and I am really feeling it, you guys. I really do like the highlights. I feel like it's really complimenting my skin. I don't know. I just like the light eyebrows. The I just like everything about this look. I think it's really cute. I did go with a wet look. I really do love how this looks. It's super, super pretty. I love the waves in this wig that it has. I didn't really have any problems with this wig, you guys, and it was really easy to put on. The only thing is that the wig is not pre-plucked and it does not have bleach knots. So I do recommend that you get ready to bleach the knots if you are getting this wig. That's what I did. I went ahead and I bleached the knots and you kind of can't really tell just because it makes it look more realistic besides that i really didn't have any other problems it, the hair did shed a little bit but it really wasn't nothing too crazy if you guys want to go ahead and check out this hair i will go ahead and leave the information in the description box you guys already know thank you guys so much for watching my video and bye